Good morning, everybody. How's it going? My name is Kart Tank. I'm one of the co-founders of ETH Global, and I'm super excited to welcome all of you to Pragma. This is our conference. If you know ETH Global, you know we do two things. We run hackathons and summits, both in-person and async. And today is our in-person summit, which is the Pragma series. We've been doing these things across all the in-person events we've hosted this year. And I'm super excited to welcome all of you to DevConnect. Every Solidity developer knows that a smart contract and an idea starts with the word Pragma. It's not just the beginning of a developer's journey, but for us, this event is a call towards pragmatism. The goal here is very simple. We want people to learn about what's happening with Web3 at the edge and use that to bring a lot more people into the space. Now, what makes this different is this. This whole event is a single day and single track. We're not gonna confuse you with 20 things happening at the same time or more than one talk happening at the same time. This whole event is also founders only. We're gonna talk about what's happening from the people who are building these protocols and how they're working towards moving this whole ecosystem forward. The focus is very much on the future. Uh, we're also gonna obviously retrospect and learn from what's happened in the past and how we've grown and understood how things could be done better. But we wanna talk about what's up and coming. Um, and for this edition only, we're gonna mostly keep it non-technical. Uh, there's gonna be some panels here today that will require you to have slightly more nuanced understanding of what MEV is. But beyond that, intentionally it's meant to be accessible to everybody in this room, whether you're a developer or you're just trying to understand what's happening in this space. Which means to make this easy, there's gonna be zero talks today. No PowerPoints, no presentations. The whole day is gonna be seven panels. You're gonna be listening to people, not watching a screen. So let's get right into it. All of you would have gotten this card when you checked in. This is a memorabilia for this event. All of you will also be getting this as an NFT to remember that you were here in this uh, in this person in, in person event. And the schedule for what you're gonna see today is on the other side of this card. You can see who these panelists are, what the topics are going to be. And a lot of them are gonna also hang around here so you get to chat with them and ask them any questions if they were not addressed in the panel. So let's give you an overview of what's happening this or today. We have 500 attendees from 70 different countries who are in this room. More people will come in and out, and that's gonna be awesome, but you get to meet people from so many parts of the world, and all of you are excited here to uh, learn about what you can do in this space. I also wanna thank some of our incredible partners who made this event possible, so I wanna give a massive shout out to ZK Sync, Zeta Chain, Ilio, Polyhedra, Worldcoin, Filecoin, ICP, and Logos, and Polygon. Uh, some of them are outside with, with Boots. You can get to learn about what they're up to, what they're excited about, and now you can be part of their ecosystems as well. But I want to get into what the schedule is for today. All this uh, I'm going to say is also on our website. That's also going to be the source of truth. You can see everything from the timings to any changes, if there are, uh, directly on this URL. But I'll kind of go over a quick overview of all these talks. We're going to kick off today talking about stable coins with Stani and Brew. Our second panel for the day is going to be all of us talking about the pros and cons of looking at various stacks if you are interested in deploying your own L2. So OP stack versus Polygon CDK versus ZK stack so with Ben, Jordi, and Alex. Our third panel is going to be about how we can actually make zero knowledge proofs more practical and what's actually happening in this space. Uh, and we're going to be bringing on Sandy from Scroll, Zach from Aztec, and Alex from Aliu. We're going to take a quick break so all of you also get to chat with each other and, and relax. So with the first three panels and then a break. And we're going to resume the remaining panels after this. So we're going to talk about what's actually up and coming with data availability. This is going to be a very interesting and hot topic for the next year. And there are so many nuances and interesting ideas that are being explored. So Ilya from Nier, Shuram from Eigenlayer, and Nick from Celestia are going to be talking about what they think is different about data availability. Then we're going to have a discussion on cross-chain and interoperability and how we can actually use that to bridge and make best use of different chains that are optimized for different use cases. Uh, that'll be Dominic from Definity, Tian Cheng from, <coughs> sorry, Brendan from uh, Polyhedra, and Tian Cheng from Zeta Chain. Oh, I got that mixed up. Brendan from Zeta Chain and Tian Cheng from Polyhedra. Uh, they're going to be talking about how they're thinking about ZK bridges and cross chain messaging. And 
then comes our two MEV panels. We're going to look at base rollups, which is a new interesting concept from Justin Drake around how you can do more efficient rollups and sequencing. Um, this panel is going to be moderated by Justin Drake, and the panelists are going to be Tomas, Josh, and Daniel. And we're going to be looking at how different rollup services can benefit off of these new architectures. And our last panel of today is going to be how we can think about off-chain execution and how MEV changes as we have all these things come in. Uh, this panel will be with Tarun from Gauntlet, Anna from CowSwap, we have uh, Kubi and Tina, and Tina Wu from Flashbots is going to be moderating it, so you get to see a lot more perspectives on the evolution of MEV. That's the day. Uh, we're going to have a lot more chances here, and as a reminder, uh, we're going to have a Q&A for talks too, so if you have any questions for our speakers for every panel, uh, you get to line up here. If we have time, we'll kind of take some questions until we are uh, we're out of time. So as you get any questions come up, uh, just line up on this side uh, to my left and your right, and we'll be sure to see if we can get some of these questions sent. Enough talking from me. You can check everything out on Pragma, the website, and let's get started.